So here we go. We're actually putting the 207 uh, epoxy hardener on here. And I'm really amazed the viscosity of this. The viscosity is really thin. So it's really absorbing in. I thought I was going to need to thin it down, but not at all. I practiced on my paddle first just to see kind of what it was going to do, what it kind of looked like. Uh, really pops the uh, color from there. So uh, two pumps have done, um, what, a quarter of the uh, canoe here so far. So I'm going to mix up some more, uh, finish this around through the other side, and then it'll probably be a, a total of two, four, six, maybe eight pumps total in order to get this done. Um, but I really like this, and I'm only using my uh, squeegee, my spreader, in order to work it around, up and down. And again, uh, I work it so that it basically just soaks in, pull off any excess. And so uh, we'll be done here in just a second, and then we're going to come back and we're going to fill up uh, the rest of the holes on the other side, because uh, again, I want to see how that works in comparison, and then I'll let you know my findings of trying to fill the holes first, sanding, which was kind of a pain, versus uh, putting this on uh, the 207 uh, hardener, and then going from there to see what it looks like, because uh, I did that. So let's take some more time to work on this.